So who is the sleep challenge for? The sleep challenge is for the worker at home, the mother who kids are off school. You're sleeping in two or three hours later than normal. You're groggy during the day and you're not going to bed until late at night. Now I'm not here to tell you that you need eight hours sleep because a matter of fact, a study from the National Sleep Foundation in 2015 suggests that different age groups need adequate amount of healthy sleep. For instance, Baby's healthy sleep range is from 11 to 18 hours. So there's a four hour range gap between what is healthy. It all depends on the individual. Teenagers need anything from seven to 11 hours of healthy sleep. And seniors only need from five to nine hours of healthy sleep. So everybody is different and it all depends on your energy out also during the day. How busy you are, do you work out, do you walk, do you run? All is individual to you, so I am not here to tell you how much sleep you actually need. But what I am here to tell you is how you can get back into your natural waking and sleeping pattern. So how can we correct that with this sleep challenge? Number one, get up at the same time every day for the next seven days, even at the weekend. With an exception at the weekend, that 30 minutes to one hour range in between. By sticking to the same times, you naturally fall into your Sucranian rhythm, which is your natural 24 hour period rhythm of awakening. Number two, try not to press the snooze button. If you press the snooze and go back to sleep, you're going to be naturally groggy when you wake back up and get into that sleep rhythm again. It's not good. You're going to be really groggy during the day. Tip number three, open up the curtains the minute you get up and get loads of light in. Loads of light is registering to your brain that it's time to get up and go about our day. And tip number four, try get an adequate amount of movement in during the day. An adequate amount of exercise during the day, up to one hour, either walking, running, or lifting weights, you will disperse that energy and you will be more tired in the evening and ready for bed. So guys, that is your tips for the next seven days. Try the tips for the next seven days and I will check in with you guys again in seven days time to see how you get on. 